Good morning. This is Rich Coleman. I am here at the Crime Prevention Association of Michigan's Conference 2012 in Mount Pleasant, Michigan. Our annual conference where we have crime prevention practitioners who are coming in from all over the state of Michigan, our municipalities who, who are working with all of the crime prevention resources in our schools, all of our outreach efforts even to our business community, but also those aftermarket products and those vendors who are here with us. And today we have one of those, for those particularly in my community, you've seen this information about the door kick itself and the door devil how it works to securing your door frame as we talk about the trend of home invasions and daytime break-ins but today we are with Doug who is one of the vendors working with the company itself and the product so we're gonna get a chance to talk to him talk about the company talk about the product itself how you can get access to it but also how important this tool is Doug thank you so much for coming to the conference today thank you, Richie. Thank you. We're, we're pleased to be here this year this is our first time to Michigan mm -hmm. and we're uh, pleased to be at the conference this year and look forward to uh, making some connections with some communities out there that have never heard of the door devil before mm -hmm. and maybe don't know that there's a product out there that can uh, help deter and prevent uh, door kick-ins, burglaries, home invasions, that type of thing. Yeah, you know, w one of the things that I have with our crime prevention initiatives in my community, we've talked about aftermarket products and at our neighborhood watch meetings, we brought out information and display tables so that people can feel it, they can touch it, they can see what we're talking about when we're talking about strengthening external and internal perimeters of their home. Your product, first time that I saw this looking across the web about a year ago, right. I was extremely impressed not only with the video and the displays, but also how easy this product is to install. But let's talk about the history of Door Devil and how it came about in the company itself. Okay, well, that's, we were founded in 2008. We're out of Dallas, Texas. Mm -hmm. So we've primarily been working in the Dallas Fort Worth area, Metroplex, working with law enforcement agencies, uh, neighborhood watch groups, uh, HOA groups, that type of thing, mm -hmm. in the Dallas Fort Worth area. So that's where we're based out of. Uh, most recently, a little bit of a background about myself is mm -hmm. I retired from law enforcement in May after 23 years in law enforcement, and most recently served as the crime prevention officer. So I actually met this company, the Door Devil, at a crime prevention conference like in, in Dallas, <laughs> just like this, exactly. So, and I gotta tell you, just like you, when I first saw this yeah. product, I was sold when I first yeah. saw it, and yeah. it's a great yeah. product, it's very effective, but yet it's, it's so simple for the install. Mm -hmm. And so, like I said, so I retired and I'm working with them full time now with the Door Devil and traveling across the country, and like I said, first time in Michigan. So. Yeah. Um, now, one of the things that we clearly know in crime prevention, when we go out and do security surveys and we're looking at how are <clears throat> the what is that weakest point of access? We look at doors, we look at windows, and a lot of folks don't understand <clears throat> it's your door frame. Exactly. That is, you don't have a one and a half inch throw that goes into the door wall, but if you don't have that portion of it secured, it's still easily defeatable. Exactly. Your product helps strengthen that door frame with the two and a half inch screws, everything that goes into the base of the frame of the door. Talk about the logistics of how this product works with your display here. Okay. Well, what, what most people don't realize is when your deadbolt goes into your door frame, mm -hmm. just like this one does, the only thing holding that deadbolt in there is this small piece of half pine wood behind the door. So basically what the door devil does, it reinforces the door frame to prevent, it, it distributes the in, the, the impact of the kick on the door. Mm -hmm. um, like I said, the, the door that when you're you can have the most expensive deadbolt system out there, the best kind on the market, mm -hmm. but yet your weakest point of the door is the door frame itself, right here where it goes into the door frame. Mm -hmm. That's absolutely true. That's and, absolutely and, and also, I'd like to add, it's very important that people understand that um, this is just another added layer of prevention for your home your apartment, your business. We obviously recommend alarm systems, you know, securing your windows. All of the, the septed aspects sure. of, of, of crime prevention. Mm -hmm. So this is just another added layer of protection for your home. Okay, and this product, when you, you could install it yourself as, as a family member or as someone who's a handyman, but you could also call one of the local vendors that does installation. And I always recommend when I'm talking with family members, watch how it's done. Get to know the product so that not only do you understand it, but you see how it will benefit you if you install others. 
and how it works. So with this product, you've got upper door and also this is flippable, correct? Yes, For exactly. upper lock you, doors and uh, upper locks? The most unique thing about the door double um, is it's surface mounted. Mm -hmm. And it simply fits over your existing door frame just like this. Okay, so there's no taking apart of the wood, there's no repainting, recalking, anything of that nature. It just simply fits over your existing door frame, just like the one that's mounted here. Yeah. And when the, we have all the, the holes that we have in the door devil, if you'll notice, the two in the middle are smaller than the two at the top. So this would be for your doorknob, um, this is for your deadbolt, and the lock at the top is for a privacy lock if you live in an apartment, or possibly have an, an added uh, deadbolt lock at the top. Mm -hmm. The reason we have one on the top and the bottom are, are simply for the fact that regardless of whether you have a left or right hung door, you simply turn the door devil over and you still have one at the top for that privacy gotcha, lock. Gotcha. Uh, and another feature I'd like to make sure that everyone is aware of is it's beveled on this end for a very important reason, mm -hmm. okay? Because your striker plates that are on your door frame now, the small striker plates yes. that are no typically only on there with maybe a half inch screw, right. this now becomes your striker plate. So you remove your striker plates uh, off of the door right, frame. Right. That's very, you don't want to try to overlay yeah. it over. So that's Because some of those aftermarket products, when you put them in, they, the door then won't close correctly. So they wind up either jimmying it out or culling it out a little bit farther. And then it's not as secure because they're trying to put both of those on. Right. You know, the original exactly. strike plate and now something exactly. over that. So this um, now becomes your striker plate. Yeah. And it's important to note that the door devil is about the width of two dimes held together. Okay, and it's designed to be surface mounted. So with your door closed, what, we, what you would do as a test before you install it is with two dimes held together, see if you can fit two dimes in between the door and the door frame. Uh, that's so good. then it'll be surface yeah. mounted just like on our display here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, we're going to be putting the information up on the screen, the website, contact information. How much is this product? We, usually we sell these in Fort Worth stores only. So far, we're trying to come up to some other uh, states across the United States um, for $59, and they're $89 online. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're going to put that information up on the website that you can see from, from their website, see uh, the videos as well as this, this project information, and being able to ask questions. They have contact information at their website as well that you can find out more about this product. Uh, we are so excited that you're here at our Crime Prevention Conference. Doug, thank you so much. Thank you, Richard. And we will definitely be plugging this product and putting this information out so that residents can see this because this is, when we talk about home invasions, we talk about trends of crimes, this is something that's just not regional. This is a nationwide initiative where we're looking and encouraging community members, residential as well as at the business perspective is to secure your external and internal perimeters. Our law enforcement personnel do crime prevention and security surveys at any possible way that if you need one, please feel free to call your local police department to get that security survey. So this is an important tool that goes along with home security and business security. This is Rich Coleman. We're here at the Crime Prevention Association of Michigan 2012 conference with another crime prevention tip. Thanks so much.